Hey everybody, welcome back. All right. Let us continue. Oh, all right. Let's see. We should be able to handle this. I'm a bit concerned. I only have five of these arrows equipped, and it's going to cost me a turn to re-equip some arrows. So I, I can't imagine it would take more than five arrows to finish this, or I would certainly die before that. Let's see. All right, very nice. We're gonna try and rest real quick. Hopefully there's no one else up here to interrupt. There we go. All right, now that we only have three, I don't know, I, I probably should just go ahead and switch. All right. Whoops, oh, okay. I always forget that I, I need to slow down and don't travel real quickly around. One day I will learn. Well, potentially. Okay. There we go. All right, luckily we didn't take any damage. Uh, I'm not going to take that staff. The rock, going to leave that there. All right, we do have a talent point. We already have Keen Eye, so I think I'm going to go with Dark Vision. Increases light radius by one and halves ranged attack two hit range modifier rounding down. Yeah. We got that. There we go. All right. Always good to find some gold. All right, here we go. Looks like he exhausted his ranged capabilities. Now this guy may be able to throw some knives as well. Uh, hopefully not. Now he doesn't seem to... Maybe he wasn't in range, but he doesn't seem to have anything. Oh, I was wrong. I'm glad I switched arrows. Of course, maybe I could kill him faster with the fine arrows, but that's okay. Close that door. Now, alright, so we do have water, thankfully. And we're going to go ahead and drink some so we can rest. Scroll of Dispel, scroll. And a spear. Uh, the spear could be worth a decent amount. I'll take that so we can identify it later. Trying to resist the temptation to move very quickly here. <laughs> Alright, arrows, always a welcome find. Oh, and someone did note in the comments to a previous video, by the way, that mushrooms do replenish both your hunger and um, your hydration. So that's something we're probably going to end up having to mess with here. Mm. Situation isn't dire by any means, not yet. That flail, that's a medium melee weapon. I'm gonna grab that. Even though we haven't really had to resort to melee, have we? Okay. Uh... Pick up the leather van braces, very nice. There's some more. Uh, yeah, we're good. Let's see what we have here. Worn, nah, nah. Hopefully, we can get this open here. And, oh, I accidentally clicked on myself. Oh, excellent. Excellent. And a ring, that's nice. All right. Still have something left to reveal. Because we're not able to travel yet. Where have we not gone? Must be somewhere up here.
Oh yeah, right over here. There it is. And we've actually cleared the whole dungeon. That is good. And we have a very nice little nest egg here. I like this. Um, okay, so identify the spear. See how much that's worth. Thirteen? Well, three gold profit, right? That works. Identify it is cursed. Alright. Fan braces. Uh, I hope those are worth something. Taking a chance. They're not. Four gold. Yeah. Gotta try to remember that in the future. Ring of elements, fire, frost, and shock resist. Alright. Add that to our jewelry collection. Alright. Let's see. So, have we identified... Oh, we need to identify these also. Hold this spell. Scroll of light. Turns on all light sources in the current level. Interesting. How much is that worth? Three? Ugh. Ten for dispel. I real honestly, I'd, this is probably pretty helpful. But I'm gonna sell it anyway because it's worth more, and I'm dumb. Okay. So flail, we just have to throw away. All right. So we would have to rest in order to get some new merchandise in here. I really thought we would find a better bow. I really thought that we would have found one by now, but we have not, and I'm not going to enchant that. Definitely not. We do have the hammer that's already enchanted, which is nice. It might be a good idea to enchant this armor. So let's do that. Immune to confuse, plus one energy, plus one strength. We'll go... We'll go with immune to confuse. And... We'll... We'll stop there for now. Let's... Let's see, so we're going to have to reset the dungeon. And I always end up taking this quest and then something goes wrong, but then the one time I did do it, I think I, 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 I somehow still failed. <laughs> I failed to get my reward even though I completed the quest. I don't, honestly don't know if we can handle this right now. But I'm willing to try. Now. You would think, oh, you, you should be concerned about buying some food. And you're right, but I forgot because I'm an idiot. So we're going to have to move very quickly here. See if we can disarm that. Probably not. Let's try to jump. And of course, <laughs> come on, man. And as you know, we cannot rest. So that's a problem. Well, actually, okay, there is something we could do, but I wonder, I would have to jump back over here. I should have, I should have eaten these mushrooms, closed the store, and, and consumed those mushrooms. But if I try to cross this again, I'm probably going to die. I can't stress to you enough how much of an idiot I am. All right, so you can see that we're hungry now. And I, I can't even survive an encounter. I'd probably be better off testing my luck against this again. I know some people may disagree with that, but so be it. All right, there we go. All right, so we're going to close the door. All right. Grab these. Hopefully they don't kill us, but it's not going to be pretty any way you look at it. So we eat that blood cap, and so far we, we didn't get any effects from it. We're going to eat another one. Uh, we were paralyzed and missed some turns there. But we're back to normal, and we're safe in here. Alright. We ate a blood cap, nothing bad happened. And, alright. Unfortunately, our food did not get to satiated. I would have preferred the food because we actually have water. Uh, so, uh, the issue here is we still can't rest. So we tried. We tried our best. Here comes our fateful jump. <laughs> oh, come on, man. It's such a sad way to go. It's such a sad way to go. All right. This th that's okay. We had a terrible weapon. We were using a damaged branch as a bow. I mean, come on. It's okay. This time, this is the run. See, this already tells me it's going to be good. Look at that. Is that a loaf of bread? I hope so. That is bread. 
course, we have to identify it if we want to eat it. Unless you're just feeling very brave. I don't necessarily want to attack that snail right now. Will you please move, snail? Man. Oh, actually, I think... Can I get past him here? I can't. Okay, I'm going to attack him. Luckily, he missed all his attacks. That snail got caught in a magic trap, it looks like. And it is now dead. Alright. What do we have here? Worn padded armor. It's unfortunate that it's in worn condition. And some studded boots, that's nice. See what we have here. Some gold, thank you. Studded band braces. There we go. Level 2, agility up to 9. Disarm this trap here for a little bit of XP. Doesn't seem like it's going to go our way. Don't want to spend too many turns trying that. A carrot and more van braces. Um, I'd probably end up wearing one and selling the other. It might not be a bad idea to hold on to the second one there. <laughs> Okay. Have we cleared the floor? Not yet. Oh, that's right. There was something else up here. And the snail is still sitting here. Alright. Something's going on in here. Grab that. Grab these. Oh, okay, there's a spider. We're gonna wait a turn. And then engage. Alright, we have been poisoned, but we did start the game with an antidote potion, so as long as we survive the actual encounter here, we should be fine. Alright, that takes care of the poison. Can't rest at this moment, so we should eat and drink. Right, good. Not gonna pick up that shield. Alright. Now we'll go back to town. Alright, so here we are with 13 gold. That's <laughs> not very impressive. And we don't have anything that's automatically identified to sell, like bolts or arrows. Uh, so, I don't know, like, if I were to identify one of these, I don't know what kind of selling price we'd be looking at. I just don't think, I just don't think it would be profit worth it. I, I, so in other words, I, I'm going to identify this because I'm going to wear it. <laughs> Instead of, uh Let's go for it. I know it's worn, but it's better than nothing right now, I think. Um, and we'll just yeah, go back in. Alright. As always, I'm hoping to find a bow. We already have one of those plate caps. Another snail in the way. And I was too lazy to search, and we see what happens. Alright, let's try to rest, but we have enemies nearby now. So I gotta try to disarm that, there we go. Let me see if I can maybe get far enough away to rest. 
No. Okay. So be it. We gotta risk it. Oh! That was not good. Well, this may very well be our last attack. Okay. Okay, this could very well be our last attack. Oh, man. Alright. Uh, but we have to eat now. Alright. Okay. Oh, man. Stepping on that trap. That was so dumb. Damage club. Nah. Grapes. We do have a talent point, but I don't have the strength that's going to be required by most of those abilities you learn through that training dummy tile over there. The thing about searching after every step, especially when you have it kind of macroed to do it three times, is that's three turns, so it's easy for time to kind of get away from you, so to speak. But sometimes I try just going, you know, risking it, going two or three tiles after a search. Just hope that my checks were successful. Right. I'm making myself paranoid just talking about it, so now I'm <laughs> searching a lot more often. Right. Uh, we still have more to explore. Uh, which way? I guess. What was up here? This thing. That's right. Another snail who just insists on being killed. Oh, that's right, over here. There we go. This time, <laughs> it's only looking a little bit better. Uh, once again, I know that I would wear these boots as long as they're not cursed. They're not, so that's helpful. And same thing with the van braces. I'll probably, probably go with the padded van braces. They are not cursed, so that's good as well. Um, man, this is rough. It's a little rough. Okay, though. Alright, still disappointed at the lack of bows, but arrows, that's good. Snail, are you really, really going to do this? Yes, you are. Level 4, nice. Pallet point, okay. This guy hopefully doesn't have anything to throw at us. I could, in theory, throw pretty much anything at him. Whether or not it would be effective at all in delivering damage, that's another question. I'll let him, I'll wait a turn here, let him come to me. There we go. Very nice. Let's see what we got here. Studded armor, that's going to be helpful. Uh, the spear gave us a profit of like three gold last time, didn't it? I don't know what to do with those feathers. There's another training gun. That's a medium melee weapon, that sword, so we could potentially use that. But we'd have to identify it to be sure it's not cursed. Throwing knife, I am just not interested. Alright, so we have to eat, and we're going to need to drink twice, actually. So food and water, 
will be an issue very soon. Secret door. So I don't know how secret it is considering the exit is here. Damaged club. And we have stepped in a trap. Man. Alright. I could try to disarm it, but I could crit fail. And uh, I could end up right back in it, so I'll pass. Celestial Spalders. Okay, we've got more to explore. By the way, in case you're wondering, I am moving with the numpad. And of course, using the mouse for certain things as well. But just in case you were wondering about that, damaged. On that. A damaged. Man, everything is damaged. Come on, man. I don't want to pay to repair and identify. Okay. And here we are with 10 gold, man. Uh, well, I, I don't know what else to do other than waste our money on a cursed sword, man. Come on. That stings. That stings. I could sell the arrows for 5 gold, but that 5 gold's not going to get us anywhere. And the merchant is not interested in buying that. Rough. This is rough. Man. <laughs> I guess we're actually lucky to have the amount of gear that we have. The, the two things we have. I don't want to attack the snails accidentally. Alright. Alright, so this is where we're going to end this episode. As always, thank you very much for hanging out. I appreciate it very much. Please hit like and subscribe if you'd like to. And I will see you guys next time.